here we are again with Precision Plumbing for Holt Electric at 1194 Partial Road, St. Louis, Missouri, 63137. I have now walked to the front of the building, to the front side by the street, and I have pulled the toilet in the ladies' room to go ahead and cable. I know that the sewer goes out the back of this building, so I came to the furthest point up front. That way we can cover the whole trunk line going across the back of the factory, all the way out to the back of the building. So I ran it through this toilet, and I ran it all the way to a 90 feet. This is as far as I can go. We still have about an additional 40 feet to the bathroom, but given the condition of the pipe that I've seen from here going across the whole factory towards the back side, every last bit of this pipe will have to be replaced. It's old 4-inch cast iron that is just falling apart all throughout this pipe. Uh, anybody that moves into this building will not have a standing chance to not have sewer problems. It's just, it's there. Okay, so let's go ahead and back up and give you a preview of what's going on in here. You see the old cast iron just falling apart all throughout this pipe. Uh, the barnacles, it's just falling apart. There's no chance of this happening. This runs right through the center of the factory slash warehouse going out the back. You're thinking that ain't too bad, aren't you? You see the whole pipe split right in half right down the center of it. See that? A plumber comes out here and attempts to cable this pipe, the whole thing will just fall apart into pieces. 64. I mean, it's already doing that, but you see the large cracks right inside of the pipe. The whole pipe is falling apart. Right there on your top right hand side, you see that? The pipe has nothing left. It's probably paper thin all the way through there. There's our first 90. Again, this cast iron is paper thin. It does not have much life left at all. It is dead. It's falling apart. This needs to all be replaced. I mean, all right, enough of that. You get the point. All this has been marked and located with depth. It reaches a maximum of five five foot in depth starting from right here in the ladies bathroom it was at two foot and now we're at five foot 90 feet away you can do the math on that tissue tampons everything that you can think of will stick to every last bit of this and you will be calling a plumber every other day and he might get the clog out but he's just going to destroy your paper thin cast iron that you have left Oh, man. As you can see, this pipe is toast. All right. All right, check that out. That's the drop right there. Across the way is the toilet in the men's bathroom comes over, they both drop down in this hole right there. See that hole? That's your main. Back to back toilets, drop down. Get ready to come up out of the toilet. There you go, let me clean this off for you. All right, good deal. So again, here we are in the front bathrooms. Swing this around and give you a view of the building and see exactly where we're at. We're walking out. Side to side, back to back bathrooms located in the front of the building. As you can see, your main four inch stack right up there runs through. Between the two bathrooms right here, you got two, you got a drink station. Here's where the sewer pipe runs out of these two buildings. Bathrooms.
showing you a view of where the stack was at above the two bathrooms and how it runs directly in front of the bathrooms as well. Again, Josh Finch Precision Plumbing. Today is going to be August 3rd, 2018, 1194 Pershall Road. This is disc two. We have now covered all the pipes inside the building. We are now going to go out to the back door, go through the clean out, out located in the driveway on the back side of the building, and see where we go with that. Thank you very much.